is Mourinho and today he's choosing my team. Let's start with the goalkeeper. We're gonna get a Dream 11 from this Oh My Gold video. But, oh, Peter Czech? Nice. I think there are a few versions of Czech right now in the game, but he recently got his moments card, which I'm very excited about. 550k is a bit pricey, but I don't care. I'm taking him because Mourinho wants him and he has a helmet in game. Right back next, or maybe a three back. Maybe a Spiliqueta. Right back. Yes. Sergio Ramos. That is absolutely huge. I don't know if that's the right back or if he's playing a three back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this like this. We're very lucky because normally Ramos has a gold card and that's it. But he just got an NPC. We complete it and then we can put him in the team. There you go. That's the last NPC for Sergio Ramos. Oh my God. Look at that trim. Church. Ramos goes in. Let me guess. He's going to do a center back. He's going to be like John Terry or something. Yeah. Yeah. Terry, Terry, Terry. I knew it. <laughs> I think John Terry is not in the game. Yeah. You can see he's not in the game. So instead, he will be an icon if he was in the game. Let's get an icon. What about an icon English center back? Oh, I already own Ferdinand. I know he wouldn't be on his dream team, but whatever. Instead, maybe I could do someone that he actually managed. You know what? He was Cesar Spiliqueta's manager for about 100 games. So let's get a Spiliqueta on. He actually has a very interesting card. I think it's a winter world card. 43k and it's absolutely... Absolutely better than nothing, is it? So, good. I could have realistically done Pepe, but I'm scared about Cam. Because if I lose my next game, I'm going to discard a random player from my team. So, yeah, I need to make sure it's good. I just realized we could have also had Smolin. I don't think he's going to choose Smolin, so what about we buy him? He's not expensive either. He's super fast, so let's put him on the bench. Why not? And I love his haircut too. He's just as good, if not better than Ferdinand. So, let's get rid of Ferdinand. Come on, Smolin. You stay in, baby. Third center back. I have no clue who he could be, to be honest. It's Pepe, 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 Sanetti. That is absolutely absolutely huge so we can see by now that he's playing a three back i might maintain this and then just get sanetti i think sanetti has a few versions so he has a moments card as a right back wow that could we could get that i'll be quite scared though i don't know if i'm gonna have enough coins to buy this entire team so maybe we get the mid one i would like a left one, one to be honest there it is 87 rated that is the left back card for sanetti it's actually the paces one out of them all so yeah might not be the best but 165k and you just can't go wrong with such a good left back I don't know who is our, our third center back gonna be, but hey, from the looks of it, it's a five back. Let's just continue. We might do a center mid next. Modric, Casemiro. Whoa, this team could be huge. Then, Snyder. Ah, that is very sad indeed. So I think he's playing like a four, five, four, four, two, something like that. Again, I think Snyder is not in the game. He would be a huge car though. Yeah, there you go. He's not in the game. I might regret this, but a player that he did manage was Makelele. And the thing with Makelele is that even though he has a moments card that looks absolutely unreal, if he's choosing a left mid, and this card will actually help us a lot with Kem, he does have a very big version that's very good, and he will help us loads in case Mourinho has the the likes of Slata and Lampard, Cristiano, top that are going to be very expensive. 70k exactly for Makelele, and I think you just can't go wrong. It's looking beautiful so far. Very niche though, this team. It might he chooses Makelele at midfield, doll. Right, sentiment? Essien! Ah, finally a crack card. I was looking for that one insane card from him, and Essien is just the right man. This card is, I think it was his best card until he got one new one. I'm not going to get the baby anymore because I want to start spending coins. We have the 87 rated two. You guys can see it's a bit slower. I'm not a big fan of that. Then we have the 90 rated. That's, that was very good. 85 pace was very good. But bro, 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 bro. Icon moments are out and look at this. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Fresh SCN. Someone just packed this SCN, listed him, and he's now part of our team. Would you look at that? And these two green link too. That's huge. That's insane for Cam. And worst comes to worst, we can always play him center back or something. I just don't understand this formation. Jesus. I still need to so search subs. So hopefully he finishes with the midfield and then we can buy some super subs. Come on, baby. Make it Modric. Lampard. I knew it. Listen, bro. I know too much. I just know too much. I knew he was going to go for Lampard. Lampard is an absolute baller, boys. You know what's funny about Lampard? Lampard had a lot of bad cards. Like his baby card was the basis one and he was very bad then we had an 88 rated version of lampard that's a lot older and a lot lower jesus christ then we have the other version that i think oh is a bit faster but they released this hooligan lampard card that's doing right i thought it was hooligan can't lie but it's kind of no hooligan we just got fresh lampard 2 absolute baller look at that shooting man man has 96 shot power sure so I guess he's going to do a left mid then. And we're going to be able to get a center back or something. I don't know. Come on, left mid. Make it good. 
Hazard! How could I forget about Hazard? I just thought he would have a left wing back. Someone that could defend. I mean, from what I know, Eden Hazard cannot defend. He does have a green card, which is really nice. Wow, that card is very good. 87k as a left mid. Okay. I went with a shadow, with a hunter on. Left winger, Hazardinho is on the team. This team, honestly, I will keep repeating it. He has got to have Ronaldo up top. That won't do us any favor, I can't lie. Because our chem is going to be quite literally modded. This seems to be the formation that he's going to rock. I need to start sorting some subs. So I'm going to put some players that he's not going to choose up top. We have Slatan, Cristiano, and Eto. Maybe? I don't know. He managed Ozil in Madrid. They did great things together for a lot of seasons. And I actually already own a very nice version of Ozil. If I could, I would have put Marcelo in. But his card is very, very bad. Oh, he managed Joe Cole. Bro, that is 23k for such a good card. He also managed Kitarian, I forgot. And he's currently managing him in Rome. And I already own Kitarian, and this Kitarian is huge. I forgot that he, ha he managed Harry Kane. I completed this insane card for Kane. We have two more positions left, so let's do the cam. Please, make it a good cam. Eto is a cam. I sort of knew he was going to go for Eto. I genuinely think I already have Eto in my team. I think I packed him the other day, but I'm not confident. Oh my god, flashback to when I packed Eto. Oh! What's that? Is that Prime? No, that's mid, right? He does have a Moments card. Let me consider whether I should buy that one or not. This man is 3 million coins, but he quite literally looks broken. He's not cheap at all, but I don't care. I'm taking Samuelito Eto Moments. Cristiano and Zlatan. I will get them right. Please, 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 please. Cristiano Ronaldo! There is no way you are Mourinho and you do not put Cristiano in the team. Cristiano quite literally has a lot of cards. He has a foot birthday. He has an OTW. He has... I don't know what this is. And then he has this Totti card. 400... 4,270k for Cristiano Ronaldo! Insane for us. When I started this team, I did not know it was gonna be so insane. But now I've just realized it's cracked. I'm gonna take a guess and say that his third card is gonna be Slatten. So, I'm gonna put Benzema on the bench. I mean, that's my guess anyways. Doesn't matter which one I put. I'm gonna put the highest rated one. And then I'm gonna look at my club for one more card that he might have managed. I forgot that he had managed Son. It's not like I'm gonna use Son anyway, so. As loan is fine. Let's do the striker. Right? Slatten, 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 Slatten. Oh! Oh, Drogba! Why would I think it's Slatten? You know what? Once again, I'm not going to complain with Drogba. Two million coins. This is arguably the best Drogba card ever made. 1.547 for Drogba. Boom! And he is part of our team too. A random number generator will decide the player that we will discard. It's number nine. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? 4 million coins. The most expensive card in the team is a discard. Are you serious? Why is he not using them? Bro, why is he not using the skill? Oh, he, nah, he, he's not a goal. Right, I need to get serious, lad. I thought he had five star skills. Oh, that, is that a good pass? Oh, yes, drug boom. You know what? Give it to Cristiano. Hey, what the frick was that? Come on, baby. We got this. Look at this attack. Look at this attack. Look at this attack. What? Oh, yeah, we're scoring it. I'm scoring it. I'm really good with free kicks and Ramos. I've scored so many before. Don't choke it, lad. <gasps> yes! I told you! I'm so good with free kicks and Ramos. Can Drogba score like that? Oh! Oh, my goodness, bro. Oh, yes. Boom! Two goals by Ramos. We're going for the hat trick, lad. Oh, no. Look at this. Oh, my. Ramos took the ball home, baby. And we won that game easily. Love this. You're going to enjoy when I did it for Guardiola. Click here to watch that.